So here we are, a bit of problem solving now in this question. Let's see how we can do this one. So we've got a triangle PQR with its uh, vertices. We're told that triangle PQR is isosceles and that the longest side is QR. So the first thing I'm going to do is give myself a little drawing, a little sketch. So there's PQR, the longest side is QR and it's isosceles, so PQ and PR are equal in length. So I need to um, work on this um, statement that they're equal lengths. So I need to find what the, the vectors PQ and PR um, are equal to, and then I can equate their lengths. So PR to start with, is OR minus OP and I can combine those two vectors together so that's my vector representing PR PQ using a similar method well the same method is 1 minus 2 4 so I'm using the fact that the length of PQ and the length of PR are equal to each other. The length of PQ is 1 squared plus minus 2 squared plus 4 squared square rooted and the length of PR is that squared plus that squared plus that squared square rooted. So there we are those two things are equal to each other. Now in order to simplify what I'm going to do next, I'm simply going to square both sides of this equation because if the left hand, the square root of the left hand side equals the square root of the left hand, right hand side, then I can square both sides and it's still equal. I'm also then going to multiply the brackets out. So when I multiply out a plus one squared, I get a squared, two a and one a minus 1 squared gives me a squared minus 2a plus 1 and minus a plus 2 squared gives me a squared minus 4a plus 4 and that's equal to 4 squared 2 squared and 1 squared 21. So rearranging this simplifying it into the, the standard quadratic form gives me this equation and this equation has two answers three and minus five thirds and we were expecting two answers the question says find the two possible values of a so those are the two possible values of a so the second part of the question is asking us to use the larger value of a and find the area of the triangle pqr so the larger value of a is three so area of a triangle i going to use half a, B, sine C. So I need to find the lengths of P, R, which is root 21. We, can, we know that P, R and P, Q have got the same length and we worked out on the previous page that P, Q had a length of root 21. And Q, R is O, R minus O, Q. So we can find out what QR is. And now we know QR, we can find out its length. And then we can use. So now using the cosine rule on this triangle, I can work out the obtuse angle. And work out this angle here, QPR. And that's 100.98 degrees, 98 degrees. And then the area of the triangle PQR, half AB times the sine of C. So that gives me 10.31 square units um, using two decimal place accuracy. So there we are, that's the answer to that question.